go. Here we go. Main event time. moment that we've all been waiting for. Unbelievable atmosphere right here. This is what we have all been waiting for all night. Wrestle Pro founder owner, Pat Buck, the dark horse of the list.
that Cody Rhodes came up with against none other than Cody Rhodes himself. This is nuts. I'm, I'm ready to jump off my seat. And the bell rings. Cody Rhodes making his WrestlePro debut against Pat Buck, the man who founded the company Collar and Elbow Tie-Up, of course. Cody Rhodes, the man who left WWE. One of the few to ever quit the company. Not a lot of people quit that place. Absolutely. A lot of people get released, a lot of people get fired. Not many quit. There we go. Cody quit with one goal in mind, and that was to take on Big Scoop Slam, the best wrestlers go, in the world. Here we he go. made a list of all of the best wrestlers in the world that he wanted to wrestle as soon as he left that company. And whose name showed up on that list but Pat Buck. Tonight, Cody gets his opportunity to be in the ring with that man. Pat Buck, on the other hand, looked at as what you called, what the announcer called, a dark horse on that list. A dark horse because he was the least well-known name on the list. Tonight, Pat Buck wants to show the world why he deserved to be on that list. The atmosphere here is unbelievable. Cody Rose now trying to take firm control early on here. Here we go. Nice. Pat Buck under the legs. Look at these, look at the technically sound. Up, right over. Beautiful drop kick there by Pat Buck. And we have ourselves a wrestling match. And you got to think about the other names that were on this list that Cody Rhodes put out. You're talking about Zack Sabre Jr. You're talking about Kurt Angle. You're talking about Chris Hero. You're talking about Sammy Callahan. You're talking about guys with reputations that go on and on for days. Tonight, Pat Buck wants wait, wait, to put wait, wait, on wait. a better showing than any of them yeah. as Cody Rhodes has him in a submission hold and Pat Buck quick to the ropes. Good ring presence by Buck. This is getting good real quick. There he goes, Cody. Cody is letting him know that you pick up a few tricks when you spend as much time as he did in the big time. Somebody just threw Cody Rhodes a bottle of water. He's uh, asking for water. Cody, not, not maybe, maybe Cody is not used to being in buildings like this. Cody is used to being in big air-conditioned arenas. Cody is not used to being in small, hot buildings with 1,500 plus people crammed in to see a match like this. Cody is not used to this environment. He's not used to this heat. He's not used to- Oh, this. wait a minute. Oh. Wait a minute, look at that. All respect just went out the window. And Cody knew that he wasn't used to those things. Whoa. Cody knew that this was not his environment. What the? And Cody decided oh. to take advantage Pat Buck is mad. You don't spit in the owner of WrestlePro's face and get away with it. Pat Buck is on a roll right now. They're headed back into the ring. Pat sends Cody Rhodes. Heads up. Big kick sends Pat Buck down to the Right the, in the, the face. The floor. Pat Buck just ate it right in the face. Of the Raw Way Right in his center. nose, actually. He's grabbing his nose. Heads Cody off the top. Oh, my God. Sends Pat Buck crashing down. To the floor of a building that Pat Buck has wrestled in wow. dozens and dozens wow. of times. This being Cody Rhodes' very first time in Rawway. Cody Rhodes taking all the risk he needed. Kevin Keenan wait, 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 wait. trying They're making to their way out to the ramp here, folks. Some kind That's of That's steel. Uh, that is steel. And Cody's got him Look up at the high. Strength. Pat reverses it. And Pat Buck, super oh Cody, my God. right onto that steel ramp. And I don't know if Cody's ever felt anything like that. Look at the sadistic look on Pat Buck's face after that. Because Pat Buck knows. Pat Buck knows that he's taught Cody something. He Pat is Buck turning it up. That he's taught Cody something that maybe you don't learn in Stanford, Connecticut. Oh, where are they going? They're where going the into the audience. Going? They're going into the audience again fighting like maybe you don't fight in Stanford, Connecticut. Fighting amongst the masses here at Rawway, New Jersey. Pat Buck just shoved Cody Rhodes in the side of the head. Respect is gone, and you've got two men that just want to win this thing. 
they are lost in this sea of people in Rahway, New Jersey. Camera crew, a camera crew's trying to stay with them. You talk about the body heat that's out there. It's, the, it's a late summer night here in New Jersey. Not the most pleasant. As Cody, Rhodes, and Pat Buck fight for their lives out there in the crowd. You know what's crazy? I did not see this match going this way at all. I expected a technically sound wrestling match. Big gar garbage can is up in the air. They're throwing the rules out the window. Folks, we're trying to call it as best as we can see it from our vantage point, but this is a Speak insane. for yourself. They're headed back towards the ring. I don't know if Cody Rhodes has ever been involved in a situation like he's involved in right now. They've made their way back. Cody Rhodes is to back ring. ringside. Pat Buck. We're losing lights. Like back it, ringside. It's melee. Pat picks up Cody. Neckbreaker down on the canvas. As our camera Cover crew, count. Nope. Only two. Makes yeah. it back to the ringside area. This is this is special. And it, as I said before, not what I was expecting out of this. These are two of the most finest technical wrestlers going right now. Cody it's, wanted it's, experiences in the world of pro wrestling no. that he wasn't getting where he was. Now that he's getting them, you wonder if he really wants them anymore. Yeah, he might be You wonder twice. if this is an experience that he really needed to have in his life. Does he need Pat Buck beating him through a raw way crowd? I don't think I would. I've never experienced that. No, I don't intend to. Hold on, Sam. Hold on one second. They're all the way to the top rope here, folks. Cody realizing where he is. Elbows oh. Pat Buck to the side of the face. Pat goes crashing down to the mat. And the Cody. What is Cody doing? Moonsault oh. hits Pat Buck hard. Cody this is insane. hit that moonsault hard on Pat Buck. Both men are down. Jeffrey Keenan has started the count. We're at two already. And they are engaged in a true battle. This is not a match that's going to end in a draw. This is not a match that's going to end in a disqualification. Cody Rhodes wants to check a box off his list, and that means beating Pat Buck. Pat Buck wants to prove to the world that he belongs on that list. Straight and that's shot. why oh these two are fighting right forearm. now. Forearm. Another forearm by Cody. A third one in a row. And now a knee. Knee to the midsection. Oh, my. Cody takes down Pat Buck. Boom. Oh. Big right hand. Cody back on those slippery top ropes. Oh big my drop God. kick. That could do it here. That, that one, could well two, it. and no. Pat Buck kicks out at two. Oh boy, that was close. It is a late night in Rahway, New Jersey. It is a hot building and not one fan has left. Not a chance. Everybody glued to their seats watching this in awe. Oh, right. Cody going for another aerial move that did not oh. pan out. And Pat Buck catches him with an insiguri. Only two. It's going to take more than that. Absolutely. I talked to Pat Buck before this match. I want you to know something, Dave Destruction. Pat Buck is obviously the promoter involved with WrestlePro. Right. I talked to Cody and I talked to Pat both. Pat said, and he's wrestled matches before for WrestlePro. Pat said this was the first WrestlePro show that he came in feeling like a competitor and not a promoter. He came in and only two. Pat Buck came into this building tonight focused on this match, not promoting a show. You should have and that tells you how important this match is to him. I'm around at this WrestlePro school, and training has... Oh, Jesus. Cody. Oh, my Shades God. Shades of hardcore Holly. Looks like he learned something from Bob Holly. Only Pick two. Out. Like I was saying, the WrestlePro training school has kicked up a notch cardio-wise. Pat has been training very hard for this match. It's like you can't even talk to the guy. He's very focused, and you're right. He's coming into this as a competitor, not a promoter. I know. That's what you said. Here we go. Cody going up top again. A lot more aerial moves than maybe we would expect is, from Cody Rhodes. Like I said. But Cody's got the freedom now to do whatever he wants. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Could this be it? Crossroads. That was it. Crossroads. That's got, is that it? 
Very well could be. No! 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 Buck never Only stops. Two. Pat Buck just kicked out of Crossroads. Welcome to WrestlePro, Cody Rhodes. He is in utter disbelief right now. Well, he can't believe it, but guess what? This is WrestlePro where people fight for their lives. This is not an organization where people are... Oh, he's taken off. He's taken off oh, Pat what? Buck's never stop weight belt. Oh, oh my God! And he's whipping the founder See, of the listen. company with that belt. Come on, Cody. Come on, Cody. Is Cody is fighting with passion. I did not see this If you want to wear a leather belt into the ring, then prepare to have your opponent strap it across your back. Wait a roll minute, up. wait a minute, roll up! Only two. Cody, not happy about that. Kick to the side of the head. Shades of another relative of his. It's amazing, like this is, wait a minute, what's going on here? Cody what going under the ring, and it looks like he got himself a tap. Wait a minute. Oh my God. Oh my God. You talk about going back to the past. You talk about the days of a dashing Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes is applying that protective facial mask that he wore for so long in his career. Oh it looks like he may be trying to bring back some demons of the past to motivate him to win this match. Oh, oh wait a minute. Him. A uh, headbutt about... with the mask. That's right. got to be it. He's knocked out. No! Maybe he wasn't trying to bring back demons of the past. Maybe it was just he wanted to headbutt him with something very hard. Right. But... Only two, though. Can you believe that for Pat Buck? Only a two count. He just got headbutted with a that that hard protective mask. Now what? Well, Cody by the way, all the stops. Here. A lot of things Cody has done in this match has won him matches wait, wait, in the wait, past. Wait, 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 wait. Look at the no. Look at the look at the color of that ladder. The last time we saw that ladder, it was WrestleMania. The polka dotted ladder. Tribute to the late Dusty Rhodes. His wow. This oh my god. Heads up. Cody. Oh. No! And the polka dotted ladder is used against him. A drop to hold. Buck looking for an ending. Pile driver. driver. And that's a move Cody's not used to taking. Only oh. two. Wow. wow. Cody is in a place that he hasn't been before. Cody has wrestled for years and years and years in a place where the pile driver is illegal, where, where, where moves are not done the way they're being done to him tonight. And now that polka dot ladder that Cody Rhodes pulled out from under the ring is being used against him. Oh, you brought it in. Oh, uh, Cody. Oh my God. No, 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 no. No! Oh, crossroads across that ladder. He That's got it, him. folks. Wow. What a contest. Wow. They pulled out all the stops in this match. Pat Buck and Cody Rhodes put their relationship aside. Cody Rhodes was Pat Buck's was Cody Rhodes' first match. When they were in WWE Developmental, this was the first match Cody Rhodes had. And this is how it ends in Rahway, New Jersey. Looks like Cody Rhodes has a microphone. Absolutely, let's hear it. In 2007, I had my very first professional wrestling match. My very first match. You never forget your first. And it was against this man right here, Pat Buck. I'm not going to sit out here pontificate all night long because shortly I'm going to go up on that ramp and if I miss the earlier, we'll take pictures. But I just want to say, the reason that when people get released from WWE are people like me who release WWE. The reason they come to WrestleCon is because of Pat Buck.